So, I wasn't sure if I was going to vlog today, but it's only 8.47 and it's already an eventful morning. So, immediately my toddler is asking for goldfish. My dog won't stop barking at the cat outside. It's our cat, but she won't stop barking at it. And then I go into the living room and I find my toddler unraveling what I was knitting. If it was crocheting, it would be different, but it's knitting. So I made myself some coffee. That's nice, but I'm, I drank some immediately after brushing my teeth and that's just an odd taste. <laughs> Let me tell you, it's an odd taste. So, my toddler literally just wants goldfish and popsicles, which when we make popsicles, we make them out of yogurt. So, at least the popsicle she's asking for isn't too unhealthy, but we don't have popsicles made. But, she came into the living room and I was, I was crush, not crocheting, I was knitting last night. And I'm going to show you what she did. She wanted to knit. She pulled half of my work out and I don't know how to fix it. I'm going to show you. So I put it up here. She just, it, it pulled out more from the center than it did from over here. And I guess I'm just going to have to pull it out, but I don't. I don't know how to put it back on there. I was, uh, I pulled more out from the center right here. I don't want to mess with it too much because I don't want it to pull out any more in the center, but you can see how it's messed up right there. I just, I don't know how to fix it. I know it would be easy to fix if it was crocheting, but I, this is the only way I know how to knit is this pattern right here. So I'm not, I'm not too good on the knitting front, just on the crocheting front. <laughs> but I was trying to make a tiny blanket and it's all messed up now. But I mean, she wanted to learn. That's, that's why this happened. She wanted to learn. So I changed my shirt because that's what? Oh, that is Papa. There's a picture of my dad on the fridge with uh, with my oldest. So we're going to go outside and do a tiny bit of gardening. So I changed my shirt because um, I have I have somewhere to be tonight and I don't want to get that shirt dirty. So we're outside and I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to put this because I have a garden bed right here uh -oh. and I'm just not sure where exactly I want to put it because I'm standing in the garden and I think I want it in the garden because I want to do raised beds next year and I'm going to do it in the garden that I did in ground That's so, that's so yeah why don't you swing that's so, so I think that's what I'm going to do <laughs> So in doing this garden box and setting it up, I realized something and I talk about it a little while later that I didn't have enough dirt and had to put sticks and stuff in. But I realized in putting everything into that garden box and taking eight bags of dirt to fill it up that I'm not going to do nothing but garden box next year. It's just not going to work out. So this is the dirt that I got for the raised beds. And this is the raised bed that just got put together. I didn't expect it to be this big, to be honest. I might need more dirt. But, I like it. And it'll be good to plant carrots and radishes in for fall. I also got collards. So we're going to put those in there too. But, it smells amazing. So I loaded these two bags of dirt up and in the next clip I tell you that it wasn't enough but can we just appreciate how pretty the trees are in the background for a second? So two bags 
of that dirt just filled the bottom one. And I'm not gonna buy enough to fill these. So I'm gonna get sticks and twigs and stuff and layer it in there, but I'm gonna do that off camera because that's gonna take me a long time. So yeah, two bags of dirt fill, filled that one. So I put sticks and everything in there and then I have some dried up corn stalks from my garden this summer I threw in there. And then we just went and collected a ton of leaves. We're gonna put on top and then we're gonna put that bag of potting mix that I already had and then that bag of organic mix. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm out of breath. I just walked up a hill. So that's why I sound like that. So I ended up running out of dirt, but this is what it looks like. I'm gonna have to get like three more bags, two for the top and one more for the bottom. But I think it looks good. Can't plant anything in it yet because I don't have all the dirt in it I need, but it looks good. So we came back inside. I made us some chicky nuggets. Uh, I called them chicky nuggies and my toddler was like, no, because I asked her if she wanted chicky nuggies and she's like, no. I'm like, do you want chicken nuggets? She's like, yes. I'm like, they're the same thing. <laughs> it's so cute how literal toddlers are. It's like, if you don't say the specific thing, they, even if it's like a tiny little bit different, they're like, it, not having it. Well, baby woke up. So I'm gonna go get her up, feed her, and then probably head out. We have... A place to go so I'll see you guys in a bit so it's the next day I didn't record anything past what I showed you last um but I'm gonna decorate this uh -oh. wait hold on this <laughs> for fall and just time lapse it and show you guys what I do that is pretty mm -hmm. So this is actually the only thing that I've decorated for fall so far, and it's already almost the end of October, but my mom ended up adding more stuff when we got back from church, and I think it looked pretty good, but this gives me an idea to actually decorate this for every season because it looks so good. If it was up to me, I would I mean, it is up to me because it's my house. I would leave it for fall all year, but it just doesn't make sense. So I'm going to change it with the seasons. Hey, guys. Um, it's the next day. Again. Uh, I hope you can't hear Frozen playing. I've got that on for my toddler. Uh, but cleaned off the fridge because the new fridge and dishwasher and microwave that goes over the stove is coming. So, I told you guys in the last vlog that I did that the fridge was going to move to over here. Well, in measuring that, we can't do that because the dishwasher needs to go over here and the fridge and dishwasher and sink would not all fit next to each other. Um, so, I can't move the fridge over there, but I'm going to have a pantry over there, so I'm not losing a pantry which we were gonna put right here. Well, it'll be fine, but I need to go. My dad brought a cooler over yesterday and it needs to be cleaned. He, he had it stored and a couple spiders, bless you, a couple spiders laid some eggs in it. So I gotta go clean that. Uh, I bought ice and I've got some ice packs and everything to put the stuff from the fridge in until the other refrigerator cools off. We do have deep freezer, so this freezer is empty aside from the ice, the bag of ice and a couple ice packs. But I don't want this vlog to be super long and it's like three days worth of stuff in this vlog so far. Um, but I ha I just uploaded, which you guys will see, it's like a 16 and a half minute long vlog, and it took me 
probably 36 hours to upload from my phone. Not even joking. I started uploading it about four o'clock on Saturday and it uploaded right about 8.45 a.m. today and today is Monday. <laughs> oh, so yeah, I gotta switch arms. Phone's not heavy, but if you hold out a glass of water, even if it's empty, it may not seem like much, but over time, it will be heavy. I heard that before. I just, I'm shaking too much. But, I'm gonna go clean out this cooler. Um, and I'm gonna move the fridge and mop under it before the new fridge gets here. So that way it's just clean and everything because this fridge, fridge leaks. Um, <clears throat> that's, that's the whole reason we are getting another fridge. So I'm gonna go do this and see you guys. So in I was dragging the cooler and accidentally ran over a slug. I killed it. <laughs> the guts was everywhere. I had to spray my carport off. It was bad. Like, yeah. Um, but I got that taken care of. It's cleaned out. It's not cleaned out completely, but it's cold. I am not taking a rag to that thing. I'll just put my stuff in like plastic bags because I have plenty of extra plastic bags and then surround it by ice. Um, I'm hungry. I need to eat something. I also lost my coffee. I gotta find it. I want my coffee. I'm so excited. I don't know if you can hear me through this or through the phone. I'm not sure. But they're on the way. Lowe's called me. They're like 15 minutes away and they are going to take this fridge. And we're going to have a new one. I'm so excited. Okay. Um, I had to hurry up and clean it out and I put the stuff in the cooler. I'm going to show you so, that. So everything is in the cooler. Um, some stuff I probably could have kept on the counter, but it's in the cooler. There's ice on top of it. There's ice packs from what you can see. I have some things up here. I, I do keep my sugar in the fridge. I just feel like it lasts longer. So, and then all that I sanitized last night, but it's still got some condensation in it. So yeah, but I think Lowe's is here. I'm excited. Not here, but they should be here in a few minutes. I hurried up and cleaned up, cleaned out the fridge, the, uh, the stuff. My mom and I went through it last night and we threw away stuff that was expired and put all of like the freezer stuff into the deep freezer. Pretty sure I already mentioned that, but yeah. So I'm excited. <sighs> I am like sweating because I was outside digging in the garden because I bought collards and they're not gonna fit in my garden box. So I was digging and weeding the garden and then I fed the dog and got a call from them that they were coming. And I believe they just pulled into the driveway. I just got done mopping a puddle of water out of the floor that I accidentally made because I was washing the inside of this. It's here. Um, so is the dishwasher um, and the microwave. But look how nice. I just washed that. That's why I got water all over the floor. And I washed the whole inside of this. And now I'm gonna start putting stuff in it because this is cool enough, but I don't know if the freezer's cool enough, so I'm not gonna pull anything out of the deep freezer just yet to put it in there. Cause I'm gonna keep vegetables and stuff in that freezer. But it's exciting, it's clean, and now I can put everything in it and get it out of that. <clears throat> Ma'am. So I was going through my footage of the other day and I didn't, I didn't sign off. Like I, I didn't say goodbye or anything. I just showed you the inside of the fridge and then didn't record anything else. So it's Wednesday and that was Monday when I recorded last. My mom and I did do some things which I recorded on my camera for my kitchen renovation video, but we, uh, we tore that out and now there is, it just feels like so much more space. So much more space. Loving it.
but I wanted to end this video and I wanted to tell you guys that I hope you have a blessed day and I will see you next time, which will be another video, but I'm going to record it today. So have a blessed day. Bye.